What bird uses its wings as a shield? What feathered creature is considered a master at grinding bones and eating them? And which bird should even people be afraid of? You're about to find out. In this episode, I'll show you the most dangerous birds in the world and tell you many interesting things about them. Let's go. Secretary bird. A small, strong head with a gray miniature beak a long neck, and an unusual body structure. This is the secretary bird, a very bright representative of the feathered creatures, which stands out against others with its long, heron-like legs. Because of them, by the way, the secretary bird moves as if on stilts. But why are even cobras afraid of this beautiful bird? You'll find out now. Despite the fact that this relative of eagles strikes with grace and masterful ability to dance, it inhabits African savannas and is very fond of hunting snakes. Do you think a bird with this physique won't do anything to the slithering creatures? No way. Just look here. Did you even see how this creature kicked a rubber snake? Did you see how it trampled on it? Considering that this feathered creature's claws are not bent, but wide and comfortable for striking, it's scary to imagine what this secretary bird's prey feels. This creature is up to five feet long, but it rarely weighs more than nine pounds. Although it has a hefty wingspan of more than six and a half feet, it does not enjoy flying. It loves to use its strong legs, which accelerate up to 19 miles per hour. Because the secretary bird is a raptor, it has incredible eyesight. It's all clear with mice and other small creatures. The bird notices them and leaves no chance to survive. But things are more interesting with large venomous snakes. To prevent the enemy from injecting its toxin into the bird's body, the secretary bird uses its huge wings with long feathers as a shield. If the snake manages to make its deadly lunge, it won't bite anything but feathers. While the snake is terrified of its offender intelligence, the secretary bird simply presses the snake's head to the ground and then tramples it down. African Ostrich It's the largest bird in the world. Externally, it's unlike any other bird. It's almost 10 feet tall, weighs about 330 pounds, has an elongated and at the same time massive body covered with thick feathers. All this looks impressive. Despite the fact that the body of the ostrich is quite large, its head is quite tiny in comparison with its body. It's unattractive and even, one might say, dull. The beak is soft, flat, and ends with a horned thickening or outgrowth. But the eyes of African ostriches are large and very expressive. The main thing is not to focus too much attention on them because if an ostrich hypnotizes with its eyes, it'll destroy any victim in its path. It can't fly, but it wasted no time. Instead of flying, it masterfully learned to run and strengthened its bones greatly. Most predators are afraid to even look in the direction of the big bird, which it takes advantage of, except that most doesn't mean all. Big cats and hyenas still pose a serious threat to the giant. However, even if they attack it from behind, one wrong move can cost them the whole hunt because catching up with the African ostrich is problematic, to put mildly. In just a few seconds, it can reach speeds of over 43 miles per hour. Moreover, using the same powerful legs, the ostrich is also able to fight with an enemy. Its limbs are armed with a hard and sharp claw. With such a tool, the bird can inflict severe injury or even kill a lion. It's unclear why the ostrich doesn't use this opportunity to feed on large animals, whether it's because of its small and low-witted head or because of its wide and toothless beak, which can neither chew its prey nor properly swallow it. Southern Cassowary Imagine the situation. You're resting somewhere on the ocean shore, the weather's beautiful, the sun is shining, but then all of a sudden a bird that appeared from behind the bushes spoils everything. You don't know what it is and what it can do. But the fact that the bird behaves so aggressively and too interested is alarming. What would you do? If someone gets the idea to challenge the bird, forget it right away. This southern cassowary, which resembles a furrier ostrich, is armed with sharp and long claws mounted on incredibly strong legs. Just a couple of strikes with such a weapon practically guarantees a human to be wounded severely. It's better not to make a cassowary angry. It would be unfair, however, to cast aspersions on the cassowary for excessive aggression. It goes to extreme measures only with a defensive purpose to protect its possessions or chicks. However, if the encounter is unavoidable, it's worth understanding that running away from the southern cassowary is not worth it either. You simply can't do it because they accelerate to incredible 31 miles per hour. 
And if we take into account the height of the bird at five feet and the fact that it weighs up to 176 pounds, then it's unlikely to fall. In short, the only thing to do is retreat and hope that the bird will stop being interested in you. By the way, in some languages, this creature is known as the cask cassowary. Do you know why this cassowary is called this? You have no idea? Well, scientists probably haven't figured it out yet either. Some believe that this sturdy horned spur looking like a cask protects the head from wounds, helping it to get through the thicket while running. Others believe that cassowaries use a weapon in battles for dominance. Still, others view the cask as a secondary sexual character. Either way, this open-ended question makes the bird even more interesting and mysterious. The next bird in question causes a stir not only among other birds of prey, but also in the world of land animals. Even wolves are afraid of it. Having a wingspan of almost 8 feet, the golden eagle weighs up to 15 pounds, but size doesn't play a key role here. The main difference from other birds is its speed. This ruthless hunter is able to accelerate to an unthinkable 200 miles per hour. At the same time, the golden eagle makes practically no noise, which makes it an ideal hunter. Another plus in terms of finding prey is, of course, an incredible endurance. The raptor can spend hours circling in the air to track down the most suitable prey for today's menu. As soon as it's spotted, the proud bird silently rushes down at an inconceivable speed, hooks everything it catches, and immediately drags it to the dinner table. If it's cloudy weather, it's beneath its dignity to fly and tolerate the constant precipitation. Usually, the eagle prefers to sit somewhere on the branches and observe the wind from there. If you think that in the case there's a chance to miss a prey, you'd be right only in relation to a human. The golden eagle, unlike us, has incredibly acute eyesight, which is achieved by the fact that in each eye it has not one, but two zones of maximum concentration of receptors. Nature has gifted its eyes with special ring muscles. It's also worth paying attention to the mating games of these birds. They're not polygamous and choose a single partner at once for life. And despite their strict temperament, they also, like others, play catch-up, claw at each other, or dance in the air. One of their favorite methods to surprise the opposite sex is the garland flight. A male can perform the aerobatics both alone and in pair. Having gained considerable height, the golden eagle goes down sharply, relaxing almost to a state of freefall. Before it touches the ground, it'll take off sharply and be back at high altitude. Guys, I think I found the most devoted KISS fan. It's the Bearded Vulture, also known as the Lammergeier. It's about 4.1 feet long, of which 1.6 feet are just the tail. Bearded vultures weigh about 18 pounds and have a wingspan of up to 10 feet. Often these birds hunt small game, but much less humane cases have also been recorded. In them, bearded vultures have tried to throw large animals off a cliff, pushing them. This clever act allows the Lammergeier to immobilize its target and break its bones as easily as we break instant noodles. What's this done for? It's all done for the same reason we do it, to make it easier to eat. This feathered master usually hovers at altitudes of up to 10,000 feet, though there have been cases where it's been found twice as high. Eurasian Eagle Owl most of us associate the owl with an intelligent, calm, and non-conflictive feathered creature. But what if I told you that there is one extremely powerful owl in the world which diet includes 600 animals? Yeah, you got that right. I'm talking about the Eurasian eagle owl. Its body length usually exceeds 24 inches and a weight of 4 to 7 pounds, and its wingspan reaches almost 6.5 feet. This bird can be found in most of Eurasia, the Middle East, and North Africa. It's a typical Eurybiont, the name given to living organisms that can exist in completely different biotopes. The Eurasian eagle owl is the largest of the owls, and at the same time, one of the most secretive. It can stalk its prey invisibly and lightly as it moves through the woods, and the latter will not even take notice. The flight of the Eurasian eagle owl is silent, and this bird considers silence to be gold, so it fearlessly settles within the city limits with the onset of cold weather. There's a lot of food for the Eurasian eagle owl here. The main period of the Eurasian eagle owl activity is night. Depending on the part of the area and time of the year, preferences may be given to one or another type of prey. Yes, that's how selective the Eurasian eagle owl is. Nevertheless, in most cases, it feeds on small rodents, although these owls are not averse to eat some birds and hares. Moreover, the Eurasian eagle owl can attack even ungulates. 
That's all, guys. Which bird do you personally consider to be the most dangerous in the world? Share your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching, and see you later.